what's up everybody welcome back to the channel this is mystic waters and today we are playing with works baby i couldn't wait to get back to it let's get on and pop in remember to follow me on twitter at mystic waters yt that way you can know what i'm going to be posting the next day we can talk and gigi gaga whatever <laughs> whatever we do we do it and we do it well i love that background y'all like i mean that is just beautiful in the back honey okay let's get to it i hope y'all doing good on this beautiful sunday y'all ready for super bowl i'm ready to see the weekend perform that's all <laughs> I actually love, love, love The weekend. He's freaking awesome. Love his music. So I'm ready to watch him perform and that's about it. Okay? okay. <laughs> Alright, let's get into it. We'll be holding our first off-campus mission of the semester today. It's simple. We really capture your team's flag and make it back before the rival team. And guess what? We won it. Look, friends with benefits isn't cutting it for me. I don't want to be just your friend. And being your little secret's getting old. Uh, just kiss me, Brent. We'll talk about it tomorrow. Oh, I was supposed to sound like a dude. Hold on. <laughs> okay. We're running out of tomorrow's Flores. <laughs> what a beautiful Sunday morning. Oh, God. I forgot that somebody had that. I forgot. Oh, my way. I hope we're not next. Like, I don't know what's happening. Oh, no. He's about to tell us what happened. It's with the heavy hearts we reveal that Wentworth student... Deva Andrews has gone missing. Rest assured, we will make sure a sense of this uh, unfortunate circumstance. But for now, we're giving all students a day off until interrogations begin. School will resume tomorrow and the fall formal will proceed as planned in two weeks. You never thought you'd see the day Dean Oliver's cool persona crack. A man like him struggling to hold it together before your school reminds you? A student's missing and it happened near where you spent the night. The fact that fact churns your stomach. Missing students at Wentworth of all places? Something's not adding up. The little combat, okay, the little combat acumen we have doesn't make us immune to all physical attacks, though. Deva's first year, like us, she has too, so much more to learn. Usually the first to bust into conversation, Sierra's uncharistic, silent. What if she's dead? Sierra, what? We're all thinking it. If someone managed to do that here, it could happen again. Sierra's right, we should be worried. Let's trust that Wentworth will solve this. Um, I don't know what I should, I wanna be positive. I'm gonna be positive and say, let's trust that Wentworth will solve this. I know it's a lot, but Dean Oliver promised that they're doing their best. Let's trust them to figure it out. If a fuck, wait, if a fucking, kidnappers on the loose than staying on campus today's mental illness that's not how mental illness works lord who's down for some fall formal shopping i'll give us a chance to escape this bullshit in any way perhaps for the first time in the northern Ara arapaho life ahanu's not wrong anything beats the weight of remaining in the building devil was kidnapped in or from Count me in, Hanu. A second longer here and I might just suffocate. Me too. If fall formal still on, the least I can do is be the baddest bitch there. <laughs> you and your friends <laughs> agreed to go out to relieve the worry on your hearts, even if it's just for a moment. Yes, let's go shopping, honey. Let's see it, Hayes. Hey, get it. Hey, get it. What do you think? It's more showy than I'm used to, but... It's perfect, like you. Oh, is he flirting? <laughs> Thank you, Jax. I'm not perfect, but that's sweet of you to say. You're laying it on pretty thick, bud. And yet, still not as thick as she is. Woo! <laughs> okay, so I know who he has a crush on. Oh my God, can you not? She's not even your date to fall formal. But she will, well, she will be. I plan on asking her this week. So do I. Wait, what? She got a crush on her too? Your turn, Elise. Try on some of the dresses you were eyeing. Little do your friends know you can't afford a thing in this store. Honestly, you can barely afford the oxygen you're inhaling. What you waiting for? Get to changing. 
Oh, Lord. What I got to put on? And am, am I going to be able to afford it, yo? Okay, let's see. Let's look at tool. Let's see. Ooh, that's cute. Festive. But my bank account isn't. <laughs> silver let's see oh that's cute too shiny just like the coins i don't have to afford this dress ivory yes 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 but the price tag is screaming no no hell no it's sleek pretty why yes i am pretty broke <laughs> uh my favorite was the tool one so which dress is the lucky winner None, they aren't fitting me right. The hell is she the hell is she talking about? They all fit her like a fucking glove. Maybe she's not in fall form of mood. Why not? It's only like the best part of the school. You've got to you got hot chicks in short dresses and spiked punch. What more can you ask for? Elise isn't as superficial as you. You think I'm super thanks. <laughs> I'm done. He's so delusional. Uh but what about you? Are you in the fall formal mood i was until this conversation <laughs> cool cool me either <laughs> not that you can hear me how do you even sign hey bro shawty <laughs> not sure which let me take you to the dance oh he likes him shit that's not that's right google <laughs> he likes him your friends hustle to the checkout counter to purchase new shiny things you watch the line's moving pretty fast for how busy it is. It seems all of Manhattan's on the hunt for the perfect fall formal outfit. <laughs> oh, there's the girl, Mystic. Oh, snap. <laughs> she remembers me. And we're going to do a second one. Yeah. We're going to second one. We're going to do a second chapter. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe later. Let's get back into it. We do and four and five today. Four and five today. We do a four and five today. For four and five today. Oh, sorry. <laughs> we'll be holding our first off-campus mission of the semester today. It's simple, really. Capturing your team's flag and making it back before the rival team. And of course, when I met up with her, the interest of a tone figure looming inches away from your exit interrupts your thoughts. You don't go here, do you? And then the missing girl, Wentworth student, Deva Andrews, has gone missing. And then we went shopping, and guess who I've run into while we shopping? Mystic? Oh, I ran into her. What am I going to do? Of all the people in the world you expect to bump into, she isn't one of them. Not the brawny babe from your first school mission isn't who comes to mind. Mystic, hello. Isn't that your name? No, but you don't need to know that. Oh, hey, last time we met, you were breaking into my office. How'd that go for you? Realization dawns on your friends' faces while you coolly scramble to answer. It went well, thanks for your help. I didn't break into your office. Breaking in, what are you talking about? <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about, me breaking in? Nope. The sarcasm dripping from your voice from a form of puddle on the floor beneath you. There's a certain NYSU audiovisual media department office jog your memory. Can't say it does. She takes you in for a moment, thinking of a way to proceed. Sorry, that was rude of me. I'm Ari. You two are Hazel and Zanab. Make up names following your lead. I'm guessing neither of you go to NYSU. I know your faces anywhere if you did. You're both stunning. <laughs> gorgeous, gorgeous. All three of you, actually. She makes it a point to look at you while she says it. Her gaze lingers. So which school do you go to? An L dress means it's for something big, right? We're Wentworth kids. There's a school dance coming up, so we want to look our best. Wentworth? Her reaction is unsurprising with an acceptance rate of 5%. Wentworth and New York's civilian biggest mystery. Holy shit, you're the first Wentworth students I've ever met. What's it like? Wentworth's ordinary, hard work, a spy school. <laughs> Let's say, um, hard work. Hard work, the standards are strict and there's no time to slack off. Sometimes I wonder what it'll take for me to get a peek of what goes on in there. It's so secretive. They don't even offer campus tours. Why don't you apply? Maybe you'll get to see it for yourself. I did, it was the only school I didn't get into. Anyway, Mystic, what's your number? 
Her abrupt question takes you by surprise. Why? Maybe I want to take you out. Is that a problem? She flashes a megawatt smile that nearly melts you into a puddle. She takes your number with a haste before leaving you and your friends to yourselves. The day lulls by as your friends head back to campus. Oh, she got the number, y'all. She got, she got the number. It's night. Students lollygag in the library, some afraid of facing devil's fate and others just cautious. Yeah, I hear they're pulling in random students for interrogation. If it helps us find Deva, it shouldn't matter what route the staff takes. Pass a polygraph, keep them in a holding cell, whatever, as long as she keeps the rest of us here safe. <laughs> you and Jax chatter amongst yourselves in the opposite bend of the library. You cover your class, wait, you cover class, crushes, anything to get your mind off of Deva. Who this? Oh, hey, girl. Elise Flores, follow me on the Dean's Suite or to the Dean's Suite. This shouldn't take long. The clamor of the library steals and all eyes meet yours. They don't have to say a word. You know a potential suspect in Deva's case. Oh, wait, you're now a potential suspect in Deva's case? Your mind hums with theories. Did someone see you exit Brent's room the following morning? Or is it just a random interrogation? In the case, no worries, right? Then it hits you. If someone knows you weren't in your room at the time of Deva's kidnapping, this interrogation is real. You may be fighting for your own innocence. Oh my God, you guys. This just got deep. Dean Ligari fiddles with the buttons of the polygraph machine. No need for alarm. Agent Flores is a standard polygraph test. Considering you're going to have to take it anyway for training, this is just a test run. Be calm. It's just standard procedure. I get it. I knew you would, Agent Flores. You're one of the top students here. We'll start with some easy questions just to warm you up. Are you a student at Wentworth University? Yes. Which team were you on for this week's simulation? I don't remember. <laughs> oh, guys. Was I team A or team B? Oh, my God. I think I was team B. See, we're almost done here. Just one more question. I guess I got it right. You weren't in your room the night Deva disappeared, were you? Shiza. Oh, my God, you guys. Oh, Lord Jesus. Oh, Lord Jesus. Oh, Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. Okay. Okay. So, we got to figure out. <laughs> I got to say no, but then she's going to ask, where was I? And then I'm going to have to tell her, right? Or I'm going to get in trouble. You guys. Oh, oh my God, you guys. Like, I cannot. Like, I'm already stressed about chapter six. And we didn't even start it yet, honey. Oh, my God. Thank you guys so much for watching. Like, you guys are so awesome. Make sure to follow me on Twitter. I put it on the screen somewhere around there. You know what I'm saying. That way you know what I'm going to post tomorrow. Really, I don't even know what I'm posting tomorrow. But... Um, I'll figure it out because there is, a, I'm still reading a couple of stories. This one, Rising Star, we're still reading on Beyond the Stage, so that's going to be a minute. Um, there's another story too, but I'll figure that one out. But, uh, we'll see what I post tomorrow. Just, you know, check it out on Twitter. You know, you know what I'm saying. <laughs> but go ahead, enjoy y'all Sunday. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and share if you care. And I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye!